What up, though, YouTube? What up, though? And all my fly guys and fly girls out there. What up, It's your boy, Always Fresh. Coming back at y'all with another episode of Out the Box Fresh. And, um, I did my first Nike ID shoe. You know what I'm saying? And, um, like I said, I've been, like, thinking of different customs to do because I want to get into that custom game and customizing shoes and stuff. You know what I'm saying? I always watch David Got Kicks and uh, Sophie and, you know, uh, Sneakerhead in the Bay. You know, that's kind of how I, and also uh, Retro Snickers. You know, that's what made me really want to get into, like, dang, I ain't, don't nobody in, in Detroit really do custom shoes. They do, but it's not like a big thing or, you know what I'm saying, you got a couple people here and there who do it. So I'm like, you know, I got a good imagination or whatever. I think I can get into that. So I kind of started messing around a little bit, with like repairing shoes and things like that. So um, I am saying I'm the best at it, but I'm pretty good at it. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I'm, I'm on the Nike site one day and I'm thinking like, man, I'm about to Nike ID some shoes. You know what I'm saying? Because I never did it before. So I did a pair of Air Ones. I did a couple pair of Hirachis. And um, I might have played around with some other shoes. And then I thought about it. I said, man, I haven't seen nobody in person with this specific shoe. And I, But I know y'all seen this shoe floating around on the internet. With specific custom, you know, mimicking a specific brand. So I said, huh, I should do that. Because I haven't seen nobody in my area or nobody in my city with them. So I said, maybe I'll be the first person with them. You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> I ID the shoe, put the colors and stuff together. You know, put my um, put my name on it and all that stuff. So, you know, it'd be personal. You know what I'm saying? So, uh. Here y'all go. And when I first seen this shoe, this picture of this shoe floating around the internet, I'm like, man, that's hard. You know what I'm saying? So, I didn't do the exact shoe, but it's going to be the same, uh, the same custom, just on a different color. But, um, oh, there you have it. Got your Nike Hirachi. The ones that float around the internet was the black pair with the uh, green and red stripe on the uh, tongue. So I said, I'm going to do the opposite. I'm going to do the white pair. Since I haven't seen a pair of white ones floating around. So, uh, like I say, it took about two weeks for the shoe to come. That was something like that. But yeah. But um, I put my name on the tongue. This shoe say always. The other shoe say fresh. But the other shoe I already started on. So it's like taped up and everything. So you won't be able to see that until I'm done. But uh, but I'm going to put that video up on my, my, um, my main channel. Or what up, though, fresh. I'm going to put that customized on that channel. But um, nothing crazy. I just said, I'm going to do the Gucci uh, Hirachi. Because I think it's a dope custom. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I ain't seen nobody around my neck of the woods with it. So, hopefully I'll be the first person with it. But I'm not sure, though. But, um, like I said, you know, white Hirachi, red bottom, green top. I'm going to just put the red stripe up the middle. Um, I put the lime green logo on it just to have something stand out. Because I got another pair I'm going to do. It's going to be similar. Just the shoe going to be reversed. So uh, I just wanted something on the shoe to kind of stand out. And I thought that lime green to just stand out in this red, white, you know what I'm saying, green color. Like it don't have nothing to do with it. You know what I'm saying? So I figured it would just stand out. Um, ain't nothing on it. It just say Nike ID on the inside. I don't know if y'all can see in there. But, um, yeah, that's basically it about this shoe. 
Uh, like I said, I guess I'll give y'all a sneak peek of the other one. But this is the other shoe right here. As you can see, it's all taped up because I ain't want to mess around it. You make a mistake and spill paint. But y'all can let me know. That's the red stripe down the middle. As you can see, I got all my, all my materials in the back. Uh, prepped and ready. So they'll probably be done by the end of the night. You know what I'm saying? But yep, this is the only it. It's gonna be Gucci Custom. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm gonna put the uh, the video of me doing this one on my other channel, my main channel. So uh, I don't know. This is how they look right now. Um, and then. I went and, um, cause I don't know if y'all know, me and, me and one of my, me and my good friend, my best friend, we got our own clothing line that we about to drop, and then you know, this is it, University of Fresh, some of y'all might have seen this before, I had on the uh, yellow and blue one, on the other one, my last video, but this one, white and green, and I got the red, just the red UP on the uh, back of it, you know what I'm saying, just to go with these, so, but yeah, but this will be coming soon. Like, we just trying to get everything, you know, in order so we can, like, do it in house so we don't have to outsource it. But this was outsourced, you know what I'm saying? I didn't make this one myself, but the first one we made, we made ourselves. I made a white and black one, we made a blue and white one, black and white, white and red, red and white, you know what I'm saying? Those we made ourselves. But um, like I said, we just trying to try to stack up our cheese. So we can get all our own equipment. You know what I'm saying? Do them in house, so we don't have to pay nobody else to do it. And then hopefully we can do customs. I mean, do t-shirts for other people. You know what I'm saying? I want something done. But um, <clears throat> that's basically it. I got this. I made this shirt to go with these. So like I said, I'm about to record the video for this custom on this shoe I just wanted to give y'all the before and after of what I was doing like I said ain't nothing really special it's already been done but I just said maybe I'll be the first person around my area to do it and maybe I can you know have some other people who want to do it you know what I'm saying I can do it for them make some extra money you know what I'm saying but there you have it. My first pair of Nike ID. Air Max Arachi or Nike Arachi, whatever you want to call them. Um, like I said, I'm about to put start on that other shoe. And I'm going to record it. And I'm going to post it on my uh, main channel. What up, Doe Fresh? You know what I'm saying? But um, before y'all get off of here, hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment if you want to. Let me know what you think about my ID or the whole idea, the Gucci custom, or you know, whatever. Um, make sure y'all subscribe. <clears throat> I'm trying to get my subscribers up. You know what I'm saying? I know it's a bunch of YouTube or shoe tubers out there. You know what I'm saying? But I don't want nobody in my city that do it. So. I just figure I'll go ahead and do it. It's something that I'm into. You know what I'm saying? The first time I really was seeing it on YouTube, I'm like, dang, that was, you know, it was just something cool to do to me. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a little hobby I do. You know what I'm saying? But if I can make some money doing it, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm, I'm, I'm going to try. But, um, yeah, that's it. And this your boy Always Fresh. And I'll get back with y'all in a minute.